Good morning. We're, we're, we finished up the book of Revelation and we're moving to the book of Mark. And I want to rem remind you very quickly, Mark is what we call one of the four gospels. It is by far the shortest book. It, it's written in a very unique way as, as Mark uh, puts these different collections of the stories together. Um, for for several years, it didn't have a title. In other words, the the author never introduces himself through this whole writing, and but soon they used uh, Mark as a designation, to in contrast with the other books that were being passed around. Um, this is probably the Mark that was associated with Peter in his writings. Uh, from Rome. He begins by writing the beginning of the good news about Jesus, the Messiah, the Son of God. Now, is that important? You bet. We, we use gospel as a designation for the four books that chronicle just the life of Jesus. But the gospel really means good news. So here he is giving the good news about Jesus. In fact, that's the best news that anyone could tell is the good news about Jesus, that he loved us, he died for us and shed his blood, buried and risen again on the third day. That is for you and each of us to share. Would you pray with me? Father, thank you for your love and the good news that has been given to us to share. Father, we love you, and we pray this in Jesus' name. Amen. Have a great day.